Hi, Fiona here. Today I'll be going through the theory of the five essentials for dinghy sailing and how to apply them. Firstly, I'll just do a quick rundown on what the five essentials are and what each of them means. Then I'll go through how to apply sail setting, boat trim and dagger board to each point of sailing. Sail setting. This includes all sail controls being main sheet, outhaul, downhaul and kicker. These all affect the shape of the sail and different shaped sails work better for different points of sailing. Boat balance. This effectively means how sideways the boat is. A flatter boat sails much faster than a sideways boat, even though a sideways boat may be more fun. You're also much less likely to capsize in a flat boat. Boat trim. This is how far forward or back you sit in the boat. This affects how the boat moves on different points of sailing. Dagger board. So how far up or down the dagger board or centre board is affects how the boat moves. Again, this is different for the different points of sailing. And lastly, we have course made good. This is sailing from one point to another in the most efficient way possible. For example, when you're going upwind, you're better to do a few tacks rather than try one big tack. The first point of sailing we're going to look at is upwind. So you can see here the wind is coming from the top of the board and we're sailing as close to the wind as possible. So with our sail setting on this point of sailing, we want the sail end to be nice and tight with the outhaul, downhaul and kicker on tight as well. We want the dagger board to be fully down and we want our boat trim to be sitting slightly further forward in the boat. So if you were sailing a pico, you want to be sitting on the cleats in the middle of the boat there. So in this diagram, we're sailing on a beam reach. So the wind is coming from the top of the board there and the boat's going perpendicular to the wind. So for this point of sailing, we want the sail to be about halfway out and you want your outhaul kicker and downhaul to be sort of a medium tension so not as tight as you can get it but not loose and for our boat trim we want to be sitting sort of slightly further back than when we're going upwind but not too much further back the last point of sailing is downwind sailing so in this diagram you can see the wind coming from the top of the board and the boat sailing directly away from it on this point of sailing you want the sail to be fully out and you want the outhaul, downhaul and kicker to be loose. You want the dagger board to be three quarters of the way up and for your boat trim you want to be sitting slightly further back in the boat. So just to summarise how to apply the five essentials on your different points of sailing. For upwind you want the sail setting to be fully in with your outhaul, downhaul and kicker on tight. For your dagger board you want the dagger board to be fully down and for the trim you want to be sitting slightly forward in the boat. So going across wind or on a reach, with your sail setting you want it to be about halfway in, you want the dagger board to be about halfway down and you want your trim, so where you're sitting, to be slightly in the middle. 